Timber Shriver, and this is called Options. This is my story starting before I existed, the young girl, 15, just not that interested in giving herself to the boy she was dating. But he disregarded that, he raped her, and she became pregnant, young life a blur. Her mother was disgusted and gave her two options, a boy was living inside of her or give it up for adoption. She could have easily said, I'm too young to have a child, I want to put my life's value above another's, but she understood what life is worth. She went through the pain of childbirth only to say goodbye, my sweet son. I hope you get a family who loves you as much as I do. That little boy did, and his new family loved him. He grew up in a small town with laughter and friends, accepting the straits of life along with the bangs. He married a girl who gave him three children, but soon his wife became very sick. An illness more than just a vexation. The doctors gave her strong medication. Only after the x-rays did they find out she was pregnant. Well, now you need to start looking at options, the doctor told him pregnant. Their next child was supposed to be born with problems, and options may consider killing that child. Killing that child because it might be annoying to take care of later. Killing that child because it might become an inconvenience. Killing a human because you have better things to worry about. I know a lot of you don't want to hear him saying. You want to think that it's okay. You want to think that there's a parasite, not a future child playing in a sandbox. Hiding with mom and dad when the thunder is deafening and bringing home scribbled portraits from the first day of school. You might see an option, but I see a future. The young couple knew that child had a beating heart. It deserved a chance at least to start. They loved that child before they ever even knew it, as much as their three children that were already blooming. So that child was born, a healthy baby girl as sharp as a thorn, despite the doctor's assumptions. And we share the same name, the same heartbeat, because I was one.